And over the agency and today we're going to make again something different because I got I got some uh, tutorials uh, on my uh, my sleeve so we are going to use them. Remember the Lego house? Of course you remember. That was my previous tutorial. Well, uh, I had to create some uh, objects because uh, the Lego house was actually a game, but the game is not enough with only uh, the decor, not a decor, but uh, architecture. So I made a Lego house. But that's not enough. You all, you also need uh, some uh, playable characters, some purpose, some reason why you need to play the game. And so we are going to make this in this tutorial. So in this tutorial we are going to make a playable character, right? Actually not. What are we going to make is I am going to create like three objects: a uh, Lego brick, a uh, Lego B, and a uh, Lego car. Uh, yes, so this tutorial I'm going to make free objects and not YouTube celebrity nor um, Architecture or modeling just 3d just free objects in 3d All right, then that's that's the intro actually. Let's get started and so the first object we are going to make is Is a Lego cube is quite very simple. The first thing we need to do is to get a reference. We import reference into Blender so we know what to do. Ah, well, the die Lego creation. I have no idea where I put all my images. Oh, yes, there it is. Oh, wonderful. Alright, now we have a reference. Change to material so that we can see the image. Oh, and once again, we need to change to cycle. Uh, material again? No. Right? Okay, so what I need to do is to add a texture as an image. Yep. Right? Use nodes. Alright, and there I can change. Yes, and there it is. Whoop. Uh, by the way, don't uh, don't look at the on the right. There is a Skype. Don't don't mind that one. It's not important. All right. Good. Very good. Nice. Now uh, we are making the cube. We are going to extrude it, scale it to have the shape of the Lego cube, and um, we also do the circles. And we are quite not done with it. Circle. Remember, on the left you can. Uh, you can change how many faces, not faces, but edges will have the circle. So now it's only 11, but it will be very small, so it's not visible. The less it have, the better performance, but the, the bad looks, right? Because circle is, should be kind of clean. Ah, and this one is not. Actually, 11 is kind of enough. Now we need to position it. And uh, I also here uh, made a, not, it's not called a mistake, because mistake means something I did wrong. I, there is another way to do it. Um, I should have used an array to uh, duplicate, because using an array, it's also easier to make uh, many objects. And also, you know the exact distance. You can put the exact distance between the objects. Because here I had to approximate. But also, my approximation was quite top-notch right on the spot and there it is now we need to select them all perhaps uh, make them uh, longer definitely yep and just like that all right and now select the the, the cube and ctrl g to merge the objects together maybe change the color a little bit oh. Yes, now everything has the same color. Uh, you can see that the perspective is kind of strange because I'm using the orthographic mode right now. It's a mistake. Don't use orthographic. Only, yes, now, well, it looks way better now. It looks uh, better in 3D. And yes, that's this is it, right? And so the next subject is the Lego tree. Uh, perhaps I'm going to change the color of the object. Uh, yeah, maybe, maybe some blue, pink, no. Hmm. 
that kind of looks bad. Anyway, that's not important stuff. Well, uh, what I'm doing now is I think I'm trying to import once again the reference, but oh no, I'm I'm just saving. I'm saving the file. Yes, right then I have the save. Oh, oh, I forgot to merge the object. Yes, so select the object, select the other. What? Oh, I have merged the buttons and the reference image, which is bad. Now, yes, I can move the image alone, delete that one. I am not gonna choose it. Yes, the buttons. The buttons, Lego buttons. The buttons and the brick, Control J. We have merged all together, Control Alt C to set the origin point to the middle and wonderful. Yes, it's uh, perfectly working. Right, perhaps uh, rename it to uh, Lego Cube or something, Lego Brick. Enter and voila, make it visible because we are not going to use it uh, anymore right now. As I was saying, we are going to make the plane and add reference to the plane. Okay, so image texture and now open. Uh, go to the desktop where it is, Lego house, and there's the actual tree. Right, we need to set the texture. Okay, the texture is set but it's not visible. What is going on? What the heck is going? Where is my. What, 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 what? Oh, my God. Oh, is that. What's going on? Oh, the texture is the texture the problem. Yes, texture or com no, 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 no. Let's go to material. Yes, and change. I need to delete the material. Delete the first material. Come on, it's so easy, right? What is going on? Perhaps that was the reason why I should even record it like this. So, okay, what's going on? Right, that was kind of strange. I have no idea what happened. So, this is how the Lego tree should look like. Well, it kind of looks kind of complicated, but we are not going to make it just like that. We just just a reference to the tree. Actually, I don't think I needed a reference because what the tree I was going to make is quite easy to make. So anyway, let's make the root. Right, that's kind of impressive. And uh, now I should have used only this object, but I am duplicating it for some reason i could have used the only one object and then select the face and then extrude it and scale it and then extrude it again but for some reason i didn't thought of this and i just uh, duplicate the object which is a wrong way to do things it's, uh, it's wrong so now i'm thinking hey i can extrude and then scale which is what I should have done to the root, but I did not. It's a mistake. And now once again extrude and scale and do this a couple of times until I am happy with the final product. Final product. Final tree. Lego tree. I mean, it's not specifically a Lego tree. Uh, by the way, I'm going to use this tree uh, initially, I thought I was going to use the tree to make a maze in the forest. So the trees would be the actual walls of a maze, which is situated in the forest, which I already said twice. But then I decided, hey, it's, it's kinda, it's kinda too much to duplicate, duplicate, what? Dupli duplicate. To duplicate, what? Wow, that was, that was quite a, a different, wow. It's just kind of bad. Duplicate. Duplicate. Right, so duplicate the object and uh, move them around and then add to all of them uh, some uh, uh, colliders so that the player cannot go into them but they will be stopped. 
yeah this is kind of it's kind of hard to do so yeah i decided just to make just to make a maze which is way easier than to make and place the trees as a wall i just created a maze by myself We should definitely do less time than actually making a maze. Actually, the maze took less time than actually he duplicated the trees. And I'm almost done with this. It doesn't look. Uh, actually, it does look kind of bad. Yeah, I yeah. If you if you don't think this looks bad, I mean, look at it. Oh come on, the proportion is so wrong. It's so wrong. I, wrong, wrong. This is so wrong. But I'm sure there is some uh, trees, toys like that, definitely. But that that proportion, the proportion are so bad. The, the tree is so small, but it should be doesn't look good at all. Now I am selecting faces and then I'm scaling it. I think, right? Okay, yes. Yep, but I'm not scaling on the right side. I should. Yep, I have only selected. Oh. Yeah. So to select to select the outdoor house, yes, you need to go into this mode. I don't I'm sure how this mode is. Uh, maybe X-ray mode. X-ray mode. It's maybe called X-ray mode. Yeah, that's a good name. Right. So I'm scaling it like this. Yes. Yeah, and then move it a little bit. Bap 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 bap. Oh my god. Well, this this is like a tree. Yeah. If you don't see the difference between that, this and the other one, uh, perhaps you are blind or you are not a good designer. So you should. Uh, I'm not sure you can learn good design. The good design is uh, obvious, but if you don't know how to do it, yeah, you don't know how to do it. But you have. It's obvious that you can. You know by default. What the good design is. Oh, so now I, I think I'm doing it right now. Yeah, so I have deleted that part and now I'm going to select the faces, right? Yes, select the face, extrude, and then scale. Please tell me I'm doing this. Yes, I'm doing it. So now it will be only one object. This is what I should have done at the start. Yeah, this is, yeah, a good, a good tree. Yes, it's it's quite yes, quite impressive, quite good. Mm -hmm. That's how a tree should look like. Okay, why oh, I'm selecting the faces again? Yeah, that's a very good question. Why I'm doing this again? Yeah, okay, I'm selecting all the faces and then scale it again. Yeah, I mean, yeah, it looks, uh, it looks better. Yeah, I guess it looks better. So what I'm going to do now is duplicate the object, I think. Yep, duplicate it and then I'm gonna scale it again. Perhaps. Why is that? Okay, it's kind of strange. The face was not selected. All right. Yeah, it kind of looks good. Yes, yes. And then scan it again. All right. Just, just like that. Oh, wonderful. I mean, you can now see the difference between the other one and this one. If you don't think that the one on the right is better, then something is wrong with your eyes or with your mind. Hopefully, it's your eyes only, and that's let's hope that. So now I'm going to add uh, some colors, some different colors. So the 
the leaves of the tree are green, of course. I'm talking about leaves, but there is no leaf on the tree. There is a suggestion that there is leaves on the tree because everyone knows the trees have leaves, right? Also, if you don't know that the trees, all the trees have leaves, um, once again, something is wrong with you, and um, yeah, something is wrong with you. All right. My name. I was going to say that my name is uh, Peter Pie, but uh, my name is not. My name is Obi the Artist. Right then, once again, we're going to select the, the other part, the root, and make it a rootishly color. A rootishly color, which is. Have you guessed it? It's kind of blue. No, it's not blue, it's green. Of course, it's not green, it's um, orange or brown. Brown, yeah. It kind of looks, yeah, it looks, yeah. Mm -hmm. But you can see just on there on the left, there's some green part. Yep. What? Why did that happen? Right? Just no, doesn't matter. I just fixed what once again. What is going on? Yes, and now everything is just just great. Once again, I'm going to do that one to the other one. I should have created the colors. I should have added the colors before I duplicate the object. But hey, this is... Oh, actually, the reason I did not do that, because I'm simulating how a new blender artist would have done it because I would personally not do some those those uh, mistakes I would yes I would definitely not because I know how to do this And now is the time to make the third object. The third object, which is which is the bee, actually the Lego bee. Well, let's rename these objects that we have created to the trees, tree one and tree number two. Then we will hide them, and also that one I should delete it. I, uh, well, actually, I'm going to use that. No, not okay. Uh, well, uh, let's see. I need to make a B, but first I need to add a reference. Yes, and that's one. Alright, scale it up. Yes. Well, as you can see, the Lego B is quite easy to make. It has like the body part, the antennas, the wings, and the legs and hands, membrane, membranes. Whatever, I don't know. I don't know uh, animal biology. I only know anatomy, which is human biology, which is um, complicated, let's say, because nobody knows if the bees. I mean, actually, there are some people that knows that the bees have muscles, right? The, do they, do, does the bee have a muscle? Bones? No, they don't have bones, for sure. But they do have muscles. They do have muscles? I don't know. Well, anyway, nobody know. There is someone who knows, but there are very, like, very few people who knows that the bee have muscles, if the bees have muscles or not. And this is not important. In our case, because we are going to make Lego B, which definitely doesn't have bones nor muscles. 
All right then, then I'm creating the body. The body is a con, con, con. I think it's a con. Yeah, definitely a con. And then we extrude it, scale it, extrude, extrude, scale, and voila, we have the body. Quite easy, frankly. One uh, important thing that I forgot to make here is um, the body, the the lower part of the body has like one, two, three, four, five, four. Actually, there are four. Uh, four colors. There are actually only two colors, but they are in groups. Yes. Yes. So that part there, definitely you can see it. Definitely you know what I'm talking about. Because I'm an artist. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, then you're not an artist. So go learn how to be an artist if you don't know what I'm talking about. Come on, this is so easy. I mean, if you don't understand what I'm talking about, go learn some biology. Specifically, bees are not uh, biology. Yes. Okay, what I'm doing right now? Good question. I don't quite... Th that is the Lego bee. The Lego brick. Oh yeah, the Lego brick I'm using to make the antennas. Yes, yeah, so just rotate it. So right now, I mean, uh, oh, it's cold. Oh yeah, you can see it on the left top. It's called top auto, which allows you to rotate an object, rotate an object, or move it in only one. Actually, not in uh, two directions, which is quite better than rotating in free direction which is kind of hard to do but in blender is easier and also in orthographic mode it's also easier so yeah what i have done here is i have made it two objects and then duplicate them what i actually should have done is one object and then duplicate the other one I don't know why I didn't do that here. It wouldn't make so much sense. Yes, it looks impressive. Now select the objects and Ctrl G to merge them together as one object. Then I need to change. Actually, perhaps I should have not merged them together. Yes, yes, actually I should have merged them together, yes. Alright then, uh, place them right on the B body. And then uh, perhaps change the material. What I am doing right now, I have no idea what I am doing. The thing is that, yes, what I am doing right now, what is going on? Yeah, the thing is that I am uh, recording this when I'm listening to some good music and then I'm talking over it because, um, uh, because I, I want to listen to good music when I am uh, modeling, which is way better than talking over it. I am sorry, but this is how it is. This is life. I can't... I mean, I could model when I was... And I also talk over it, but... No, I definitely like to listen to music when I'm modeling. This is, yeah, that's the best way to do it. This is the best way to work when you listen to music. Yes. Right, so here I'm still in orthographic. Which is... This, this is the reason it looks so strange. Now, what I'm doing with that sphere? I have no idea what I'm doing with that sphere. Oh, yes, the sphere I am definitely using for the hand. Yes, yes, yes. Definitely. Right then, so I'm going to place it somewhere. No, actually, it will be for antenna. <sighs> yes, for the antenna. And then I'm going to duplicate it. 
as and merge them together perhaps and I'm looking for all the for the um, perspective to see yes it looks it looks very nice and I'm going to use that as 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 an antenna and then I would place it right on the B uh, I do have an interesting story with a B so uh, perhaps you don't want to listen it but I'm going to tell you anyway because it's what I do well let me remember it well when I was a child and that is not so long ago because I am still a child this this no I am still I am, am actually I don't uh what what how should I say this I'm still a child in my heart yes that's how it's yeah yeah so let me tell you the story then well I was at my grandpa house in uh, in a country because always if you have a grandma she stays in country not in a city and right now if I will make if I will have a kid my parents are in the city right now which is bad I think before I'm going to make a child I'm going to send my parents to the country so that we can go in a country to visit them which is quite better than going in a city to visit them anyway so back to my story so I was at my grandma house uh, in the country and as, as me being an explorer I went for a walk and not any walk for a long 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 walk well the thing is that um, there was a guy um, I think he was helping my parents definitely uh, so he's helping my parents uh, with the work for taking care to some animals specifically the horse I think the horses or some sheep did we have any ships? No, we don't we didn't have any ship. I am not sure. Anyway, so I went to that to that guy house and which was quite far away. So in order to get there I need to pass a road. Then it was a huge um uh, they call this a court yard? A whole yard. Alright, so it was like five kilometers. I don't know, 5 kilometers it seems less, maybe it was 7 kilometers, let's assume it was 10 kilometers, okay, so I went there and there was a house, his house, yeah, I just walk around, I see all his rooms, yeah, it was, yeah, uh, alright, and then I stayed on, um, you know, outside, outside, let's, there was a yard, Yes, I'm saying it was a yard, but it was also a uh, wall. Well, yeah, outside of the house there was a wall, a small wall. And so I stayed over it. And I was uh, moving my feet, hitting the wall. And the wall was made out of wood, of course, because this, this, wall, this wall is in a country. Well, the thing is, uh, just below me where I was staying in the wall there was a um, house of the bees yes yep and so one of them attacked attacked my feet well at first it wasn't painful okay so then I was at okay I should go home right because the guy who was staying there left so I also went home and so I start to walk and I walk like one kilometer and then the pain started to feel in my feet because I was stuck by a bee in my feet, in my leg, All right? So I kept, I kept walking, yeah, it was still painful. I remember that I, I was, um, I took a break, a long break near a fountain, there was a fountain there. 
yeah and then, then I went home yeah, it was it was quite painful ah <sighs> <sighs> bees oh boy but did you did you know did you know that bees make um what is called honey honey yes and honey is quite uh good if you are eating with bread but if you're not eating with bread so just like honey and just that simple honey without anything else ah uh, it's not so good and one thing i don't understand is putting Honey in a tea is the worst thing ever. Why would you why would you want to put milk in a tea? Not milk but tea. <sighs> honey honey in a tea. Usually not usually always you should put sugar in a tea. Not not honey. It's it's crazy. It's the taste is ugh. It makes me want to vomit after I drink some tea with honey in it. It's awful. <sighs> Alright then. Alright, it seems that my cursor doesn't move. What am I doing right now? Oh, so it seems that I have done the first antenna while I was talking about my story with the bee, which was quite interesting. If you didn't like it, well, too bad, I already told you. <laughs> ah, I'm sorry, well, alright then. Uh, perhaps I should change the materials, or not yet? Oh yes, and I have also made the, um, the membrane, mem membranes, mem 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 membranes. Or the hands of the bees because definitely as I said before we don't actually know bee biology okay so now I am uh, coloring I am setting a material to the bee and what I will oh and I also uh, added some loop cuts yes the lower body so in order to make very close to them so like yellow mm -hmm. and assign the yellow to it it looks pretty nice and also don't forget to change the wings to yellow so this object is uh going to be used in a mini game that we are going to create for a lego lego house the mini game is quite uh simple Yes, the mini game is to you get by default all the objects and you need to place them in the order, the in the right order. So the antennas in the head, the wings are the body, and also the hands the same the body. And yeah, that's that's the mini game. <laughs> it's it's kind of boring, I know. Yes, but hey. It's not me who came up with the idea, actually, so I can take any blame for it. I am so bad. I am so bad. Just bad. <sighs> anyway, anyway, the bee just looks amazing. If you don't say the bee looks amazing, well, go launch some design, because this is good design. I'm actually very proud of it, yes? Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Now, the reason why I'm stopping it, stopping from time to time, is because I'm changing the music, maybe? Yeah, definitely, that's what I'm doing, I'm changing the music. Ah, I, I, perhaps I had a bad playlist, or maybe I was sick of the song I was playing, or perhaps someone interrupted me, or though, I'm not sure. Yeah, anyway, I think I'm almost done. I don't see any other modification that I can add to the bee. Yeah, 
So for now we have the we did we did we have the trees, the Lego brick, and the bee. And the next is oh yeah, the most important one. The most important one, the one that I used in the mini game that I have made. And I'm going to tell you right now what I did. Because that would be mm, a spoiler. I will want you to want to know. Want you to want to know. Huh. We are wondering what I'm doing. It seems that I'm stopped again. Who is still interrupting me? And finally we are going to make the last object that we are going to make in this tutorial. Well, and actually it's the most important object and the one that I'm going to uh, be spending around one week around it. Not with uh, actually making it but actually uh, using it. Actually making the mini game. Uh, if you remember, I said that uh, the Lego house will have like um, uh, uh, three mini games, four mini games, yes, four mini games, and the car will be uh, one mini game that I will make during a fully week. That's like I perhaps I spend like two or three or four. I don't quite remember how many weeks I spent. So today we are going to make the car. Did I say that we are going to make the car? Yes, the car we are going to make it. So we have reference, very, um, very good reference, 
and uh, we are not going to make it to look exactly the same because of the um, uh, the copyright infringements. I is uh, what? Perhaps that's the word. Yes, I'm looking for. And the so on. Uh, yeah, it will be similar but not the same. So uh, as one uh, great artist once said, a great artist. Uh, doesn't steal, he borrows. Exactly, that's what are we going to make to do? Yes, to do. So the first thing that we are going to make is the body of the car. Well, uh, luckily, when uh, my team, my team, when we made this uh, Lego, Lego, Lego house, actually I did a Lego house. But when we, okay, so the first. In the inception phase is where we came up with ideas. I came up with the idea that hey guys, let's make, let's make the the virtual Lego house the exactly how the Lego house would look like. So the player would have a virtual map of the Lego house. That's a very good idea. Then I came up with another interesting and actually very great idea hey guys so the lego house has four rooms right they got a red a green a blue and yellow and uh, there were some uh, images on their website on the lego house website with how the rooms look like so it is a room the walls are colored in the specific color and uh, there are some tables yes there are some tables and on the tables there are some lego bricks so, what if on the, the table the player can go inside of the table and on the table it's a mini game? So, there will be the Lego house, which is a game, and the tables, which are mini games. Oh, amazing, mind blowing, as um, um, a physician will said, mind blowing. Mind-blowing. Yes, and that's how I come with, came up with this idea, which is uh, genius, as I would say. And so I came up with the... Also, I was actually... No, I didn't come up with all the ideas, but with some of them. So uh, this racing car... I came up with this and the, the maze that we are going to also create and um, and also I came up I not I think this is it I came up with two three four ideas <sighs> it's so hard it's so hard to be <sighs> the guy who came up with ideas is not easy let me tell you but um, The guy who came up with ideas, that guy is me. Okay, anyway. Uh, so, uh, perhaps you're wondering what is my game about, all about? Well, luckily I have the opportunity of... When I was younger... To play play some uh, very good and actually yeah very good games which I would have not played if I wasn't um, if I didn't have an old PC uh, the game that I'm talking about is Quake 2 oh, Quake 2 Quake 2 is amazing I oh, I just bought Quake 2 for the first time and I played like seven ten years ago it's amazing and now i finally have bought it i have not played it yet i mean i have played it like for five minutes just to see but the resolution is not full hd of my screen so but there is a mod a patch yes okay as i said the game quake 2 amazing amazing another game that i played was Grande photo Vice City. Ah, Vice. Ti come stanno? Mi aspetto se io le ho piattoso. 
Beaver 105. Ash FM. Wave 103. And some other good uh, radios. With some very... Some of the best music in a video game. And then... Then... I played the game that I took uh, the idea of this mini game racing. It's called A Bit of Crazy Cup. Huh. Which is which is a very interesting game that is not like Need for Speed. But is way better than Need for Speed. But I didn't play Need for Speed. So I can compare them, but I definitely know for sure that Beetle Crazy Cup is more entertaining than uh, Need for Speed, because I have sh I have seen some videos of Need for Speed, and you can see on the road the place where you have to go, and on Beetle Crazy Cup there is nothing that shows you where you need to go. So yeah, perhaps, but also the there is no two ways of going. You just go straight, you turn, you turn, you just go straight, turn, straight, turn. So you don't have any choices. Anyway, look, Bitter Crazy Cup. Okay, so Bitter Crazy Cup is also like... Is formed by... It contains other mini games. Wait a minute. Is... Does that mean that I took also that idea from Be the Crazy Cup of the mini games in the Lego house? No, which is a coincidence. There's no there's not where I took the mini games. Actually the idea with the mini games I took it from Tropics. And Tropics 2. Which is which there are another two great video games that um you gotta play. And I also need to buy them. What, what do you mean? I played them, but I didn't buy them? How, how is that even possible? I played the demo. The demo was amazing. Just amazing. Alright then, so uh, the mini games in the Beetle Crazy Cup. Uh, there is um, the cross. Which uh, you race with a car on sand, with some specific cars. Um, uh, jump, which you have, um, you get, you need to gain speed, and then you have to jump higher, and then you land, and um, you get points. Uh, how far are you from the the land? And when you hit the ground, um, uh, that that's the cross jump. Then also the race, which is actual race. And then finally, the monster track, which actually I took the uh, the idea of this uh, mini game from the the monster race is about driving a monster race obviously and avoiding obstacles there are two types of obstacles those who, who if you hit them you you stop you can go further and you need to go back a little bit and then turn or the obstacles that took the time from you there's a obstacle that give you time but those are not important What is important is the one who takes time. So actually, I took that, and I borrowed that idea from that, and I implemented it into this. And I will implement it ob uh, because I didn't. I actually did it, but not in the time that I did this tutorial, but in the time that I'm uh, speaking about this tutorial, I have already implemented the mini game. Uh, perhaps. Future president past is so is so relative. Yeah yeah they are so relative, yes, yes. Anyhow, let's see what are we doing what are we doing here? Hmm yes, I have the wheels on the car. Very nice. 
very, very nice. So this car is very simple. Uh, the car doesn't have physics or suspension because this is a Lego, the Lego car. The Le a Lego car doesn't have any of suspension like or physics because it's actually a brake made of brakes. And also the wheels are brakes that don't spin. I I could have made the wheels to spin. But I decided not to because uh, in the game engine that I'm using, which is Unity, <laughs> worst Unity, uh, worst game engine ever made. So in Unity, uh, you cannot. I mean, actually, you can uh, see, but the 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 place, the way I place the camera is that you cannot see the wheels uh, from behind of the car. So there's no reason to make them spin. Actually, I first thought that I should put the camera in, in a way that you cannot see the wheels so that I don't have to make them spin. Because I'm not, I'm not lazy, I could have made the animation of the wheels. Actually, the animation of the wheels is just the rotation of the wheels. And I played the animation only when it was way easy to make. But I have decided not to make it because the wheels are not visible anyway. So, yeah. Yeah, anyway. As you can see, the shape of the car is quite, mm, is quite good. For a Lego house. Lego car, actually, not a Lego house. I'm saying Lego. Did, did you know, fun fact, fun fact, did you know that Lego was invented in Denmark? Huh. I have not, I did not know that. Also, did you know that because the Lego was invented in Denmark, uh, there are many, uh, um, places, places, places in Denmark, shops where you can buy Lego, Lego toys, and also there are some specific Lego uh, stores. That you can buy on Lego stuff. That's quite yeah. That's yeah. That's something. And I also saw in a uh, in Lidl. Definitely there is Lidl somewhere in where the the country where you are because they came from uh, Romania and in Romania we have Lidl's. Two or three, or four. I don't I I don't remember how many we had in my city. In my city. Anyway, and also in Lidl you can find this in Lego. Some Lego Star Wars, but not the Clone War, which is the best Lego Star Wars that there is. The Lego, uh, the Lego from the seventh movie, the the Force Awakens with Rey. I'm not saying that movie is bad, but the fourth, the fifth, and the sixth, and actually the third, the half of the third movie. They should not exist because Anakin would never killed try to kill Obi Wan, in my opinion. After I saw all the, the Clone Wars, wait, wait, I should not talk about Star Wars right now. Just go back, just go back to Lego. So Lego was uh, created in uh in Denmark. Also, fun fact: the the guy who invented the the brand Lego is dead. Fun fact: his son is still alive. Fun fact, he will also die. Another fun fact, yeah, we all are going to die. Fun fact, ha 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 ha. Ah, that's kind of sad. Anyway, what what else can I tell about Lego? Well, the specific when when you hear the word Lego, the the thing that uh, bumps into your head. The first thing that bumps your head is that the Lego bricks have uh, two, four, four um, circles, cylinders, on top on a uh, brick. And 
on them if the size of the brick is not small enough the actually the size of the, the cylinder in circle is not small enough you can see lego written on it but you didn't know that but that's actually there's some bricks that they have uh, written on them lego i'm not sure if they all of them have something like that but I am sure that some of them have. So the specific, the um, yeah, you can recognize a Lego brick by having a cylinder on top of a brick, and that's Lego for you. And one more thing that I want to say is that the Lego Lego logo which is a square, a red square, and on it it's written with green or yellow, yellow, with yellow, it's written with yellow Lego. The, the design of the, the logo is quite bad in my opinion, and I am definitely not the only one who thinks that. Perhaps I should done right now a search on Google to see some good Lego design. Let me try to do that right now. I'm curious. Let's see Lego design. Actually, I should have placed Lego redesign. And yes, we can see here. Okay, so the first result. A redesign, but it's it's worse than the original. And here we have, yeah, this is this is a good one, the Lego. Actually, I just found out that the Lego, it's um the Lego Lego, Lego logo, Lego logo, logo Lego, the Lego logo, <laughs> the Lego logo, the Lego logo is a square, a red square, and inside it's a uh, text in white, not in yellow or green. It's in white. This this Lego is quite this logo is quite is quite good. It's a round. It's an oval. Red shape, and inside of it, there is Lego written with white, but the the typography the font of the text is quite is quite nice, and also there is a line. On the middle of the oval, yeah. This 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 is a good logo. Yeah, this is a good logo. But the original, it's no. I don't like it. I don't. I don't know. I don't want to see it. This is bad. So it seems that they uh, nobody else came up with new design. Perhaps, perhaps if I try new new design, some things no. Okay, so people did not try to redesign the Lego, the Lego logo, the Lego logo. All right then. Oh, 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 this is going so so slow. Uh, why am I moving so slow? Well, people did not try to redesign the logo of the Lego. Perhaps the reason is because they don't care about their logo, or perhaps Lego is not so popular uh, between uh, in the design, the logo design uh, industry. Logo design industry? Yeah, it's an industry, right? Everything is an industry. I'm thinking right now if I should uh, make a design. I mean, if I should personally design the logo of the Lego. But, hmm. I mean, I could give it a try, but I don't. I'm not sure if I can improve it in any way. I mean, definitely I like, can make something different, but I'm not sure if I can uh, make it something uh, very good. I mean, definitely I make it uh, better than what it is right now, but I'm not sure. Okay, so if right now what I'm doing with that, that's a mistake. 
because what I'm doing there is I'm deleting the faces but I'm not sure if I am creating the faces back Lego, Lego house, Lego. Upload to me today. Send me a file. Lego upload. Lego, Lego upload. Lego, Lego upload. Upload to me today. Send me a file. Lego upload. Lego, Lego house, Lego, Lego house, Lego house, check it out, check it out, Lego house, for free, Lego house, check it out, check it out, Lego house, for free, Lego house, because it's bad, bad as hell, hell, yeah, Lego, Lego house boy, Lego, Lego house, but Lego, Lego house. Okay, so that was that was Lego house song team song. Definitely, that's exactly the team that they are going to make. Hopefully, I will not get sued by Mega Upload for uh, redesign their team. But actually, I cannot be sued because Mega Upload is not anymore. So, um, ha, 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 ha. Just try to, just try to sue me. Come on, Mega Upload. Can you do that? You cannot. Because you are not existing anymore. Ha, ha, ha. I mean, I was kind of sad when Mega Upload was, uh, was closed. And the guy who created Mega Upload was sent to jail. For um, I have no idea why he was sent to jail anyway. Because bad people send good people to jail. That's exactly what happening. Ha! Mega, mega upload, upload me, send me a file. Mega upload. Mega upload, upload me the taste to be a file. Mega upload, mega, mega upload, mega. Upload me the taste to be a file. Mega upload. And now we are going to make, I have no idea what I am going to make right now, I think, perhaps, what I am going to do right now is I am going to color the parts, and definitely that's what I am going to do, for sure. Well, let's see what, what I am going <laughs> to do. Well, it took... This this time I record uh, somewhere else and also in another day because a <laughs> reasons was not an actual reason just that I was lazy 
not actually lazy, but I had to do something else. And now, finally, I am going to do what I was supposed to. Well, well, we are back. Don't worry, don't worry. I am still going to make a video per week. Well, that's the plan. Probably I will not. No, 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 no. I will definitely make a tutorial each week. It's just, that's exactly how I said I'm going to do, and that's exactly what I'm going to do. I don't lie. I just tell something different, but that's not a lie. Okay then. So right now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to make some uh, circles, some cylinders in us on the back of the car, some small, so that the car will look like a Lego car. Actually, it will definitely look like a Lego car. Why? Why? Why is that? Would you ask me? Well. That's obvious, it's because of the cylinders and also the design of the car, but less the design and more the cylinders. Whew. Oh yeah, oh yeah. And now what I am doing is I am duplicating it and once again that is not how you are supposed to do it. I made another mistake. What you are supposed to do, and I've said this one uh, a lot of times. Well, let me tell you something. Right now, I try to. Uh, wait, wait, just. Uh, okay, somebody is calling me. Wait, just. Uh, wait, wait, just. What do you want? Oh, wait, just wait. Like, I will call you back after six minutes. Good. Nice. Alright then, I am back. There was just a call, doesn't matter what. Yes. Well, what I was saying. Oh yeah, I was trying to get on the Facebook and to see um, if I got my money, if someone uh, sent me some money on Facebook, because uh, uh, someone needs to send me some money on Facebook. And guess what Facebook does? Facebook tells me, hey, hey go to... Hey, go to go to install yeah, a Facebook Messenger, which is kind of crappy, because uh, well there are lots of reasons. And uh, yeah, actually, let me tell you the reason. The reason is because it's. <sighs> It uses a lot of space, it's like one gigabyte, well, one gigabyte, if you don't know what one gigabyte is, uh, let me tell you, in games, by city, it's 600 gigabytes, uh, megabytes, sorry, goddamn, alright, so, uh, you take two by city, to by city, grande photo by city, and you put them in one giga, almost one giga. So one stupid messenger takes one freaking gigabytes. That's like two grand dev auto. Perhaps it's GTA free and GTA Vice City all together is one gigabytes. I'm not sure about it, but that's I think that's yes. Facebook. Messenger, it's using one gigabyte. If there's not enough, it also uses a lot of internet and also it uses a lot of battery. 
so uh, whoever is using messenger well good for you sir good for you and the thing is that I cannot get to see my messages on Facebook when I'm using Chrome or any other browser for a fact because if I try to get on the message it automatically sends me to the Play Store to the Google Play Store where I should download I could download Messenger which I will definitely never do perhaps I will definitely install it once but rate it one star and then uninstall it and also give it a bad bad rating just because because I can so yeah don't install messenger so as you can see here I am just changing the colors to all of them individually because I I should have not done that I should have created an array of cylinders I didn't thought of that then but well now I did who knows what I'm thinking not even me not even I know and what do I know huh well yep well this is kinda uh, yes it looks very nice I mean yeah it, it kinda looks very nice I don't know if you don't agree with me then you are definitely blind perhaps you should try to learn how a good design looks like because if you don't know this is a good design Mm -hmm. looks, looks pretty pretty impressive pretty nice yeah and one more thing that I just uh, observed after I imported the assets in uh, unity unity a game engine probably the worst game engine ever made reasons there are enough reasons to hate it anyway so as I was saying I imported in unity and I just observed that the back of the car is not visible actually some parts some faces are missing that is because the way I created the object so basically I made another mistake but don't you worry the fix was very easy I mean I actually did not fix it but the fix would have been easy the fix would have um, contained just select everything and then invert it somehow this, this, this is quite easy I don't know I'm not sure if it would have worked on all the objects because we have like different objects but I guess I guess it would have worked that's amazing well actually we are done now I'm going to export it as a die so in order to access it in unity